Hello, YouTube. To borrow uh, Thomas's greeting, just wanted to check in and say hello. I don't know how much time I have on this, so I'll make this quick. This is um, a new-to-me pipe, another Meerschaum lined. don't know exactly what type it is. Filled with Autumn Breeze, Corona and Deal, Autumn and Breeze once again. It's rapidly becoming my go-to. I think I might actually be getting the hang of this. Um, nothing really to add. It's been a quiet Sunday. Visited my sister. Got the scuttlebutt on other family members. And without bad-mouthing anybody, I just basically said, Letty, aren't you glad that you're still single? That's all I'll say about that. Been following 2 a.m. pipe on the patio. He accompanied by did my Sunday walk this morning. Caught up on that. Bearded Welshman as well. There's a guy that's uh, looking to live his life more simply, craving human connection. That's a great, and I completely agree with him, but unfortunately, I'm too much of an introspective person uh, to actually go out and meet people. So good for him. Good for him for telling him to unplug and meet pe real people, have real conversations. That's something I have to make myself do. You know, you start these videos thinking you know what you're going to say, then you completely forget once the, t once the quote unquote metaphorical tape is running. Mm -hmm. Had Stephen on the on the large telly yesterday. I casted his video to the television, and uh, he's listening to Godspeed, Black Emperor of all things on vinyl. So, with every video I see with Stephen, he becomes more and more of a Renaissance man in my eyes. But Godspeed, Black Emperor, and he knows who the Cramps are. So good on him. Come on. Um, got a little dummy that time. Holy Smoking Pie Padre did his Halloween video a few nights ago, and he accidentally reinvented trip hop again. Trip hop is um, as it sounds, a form of electronica that uh, takes the takes the breakbeat of hip hop and slows it down, makes it sound like it comes something like something out of a soundtrack. But there's different iterations of trip hop. So. If you listen to the beginning of his Halloween, he combines one piece of music with another piece of music faded in the background, and it really creates a spooky atmosphere. So um, I turned him onto some Portishead, an old trip hop band from the 90s, in the Bristol era. That's where trip hop is, I guess that's the mecca of where it all began, I guess, but with Massive Attack. Later, Tricky, and then Portishead. I'm a sucker. For anything that for soundtracks and anything that sounds like it belongs in a soundtrack. And Trip Hop definitely does the trick. So I'm gonna make him a mixtape of um, 
different tracks that have that sort of like otherworldly kind of spooky vibe. But again, trying to describe describe trip hop like any other type of techno, there's so many slivers and subgenres to the whole thing. It's almost useless except to just put the tunes on and just let the person judge for themselves. But Portishead is a good starting point. Especially those first two albums. Northeast Piper UK. Always good to hear hear you speak. Good trading messages with good trading messages with you as well on Facebook Messenger. Just checked in with Professor Jeremiah. He's in West Africa. I said, Professor, we need a video from you. And and lo and behold, on the same day he was making one even as I requested it. So some some weird sort of pipe smoker telepathy there. I gotta say, I do like this autumn breeze. It's very creamy. Very, very, uh, well, just smells good, tastes good. And I love this, I love these mirror line pipes. I bought this with the other one, the big one that would not ignite a couple of videos ago to save my life. Looks like something uh, Fred McMurray might smoke. Uh, but I'm nowhere near as dapper or as fatherly as Fred McMurray, but he is um, one of these celebrity pipe smokers. I'm up to seven minutes. I wonder how long this is going to let me go for. And Beerbeard knows who the Cramps are, too. This uh, gothabilly band from the early 80s, post-punk. Just imagine the Munsters and Rockabilly combined together, and you've got the Cramps. Sadly, they're now defunct because uh, lead, singer, lead singer Lux Interior has passed on, but get some early Cramps. They're really, really good. I would recommend Bad Music for Bad People by the Cramps. Sleazy Gothabilly. Gotta love it. Perfect for Halloween. Well, I don't have much to say today. I just want to say hello, really. Um, of course, I'm trying to like think of shout outs, and I'm, you know, the more I think of them, the more time I'm running out of. So I'm just going to leave it there, finish my pipe, and uh, we'll speak to you very, very soon. Also, hello to Johan. I told him, he said, uh, I'll watch your video tomorrow. That means I had to make a video for him to watch. Got to throw my hat over the, over the wall. Anyway, all the best to you folks. Take care.